Isn't it such a beautiful night? Oh, it's a perfect night for sailing to Bermuda. Oh. Well, you know, since Liz let me borrow the clothes tonight, there's no need to wait until tomorrow to leave like we planned to. <laughs> you are as happy as a kid at Christmas, you know. Oh, I can't wait to be in Bermuda. I I'm going to an elegant dinner and ball and... I'm trying not to get my hopes up too high, but wouldn't it be wonderful if someone at the resort recognized me? Just someone knew who I was. You know, the closer we get to Bermuda, the more I wonder what's in store for me there. Really? You know, I hadn't noticed. I know. I'm sounding like a parrot, repeating the same thing over and over, and I'm trying not to get my hopes too high. I know, but you can't help yourself. I just want to find out who I am and where I come from. You must think I'm so silly to still be so hopeful. Never. I admire you for having the faith and courage to not give up. Without you in my corner, I would have given up on hope a long time ago. And so wonderful, so supportive. You know how I feel about you. I just want you to find what you're looking for. Brian, there's something in the water. What is it? I can't tell. Well, easy enough to find out. Ah, it's just a bottle. Someone threw their trash over. That's it. Maybe. Maybe not. Can you snag it so I can see what's inside? <laughs> yeah, whatever makes you happy. I can't wait to get a closer look. There is something inside it. I knew it! It's a letter. You're kidding me. No. It's a love letter. Listen to this. My love, I hope this letter reaches you. You wrote a letter to Sharon, put it in a bottle and tossed it into the ocean. That's right. Do you even remember what it said? Yeah. I remember every word. It started out. My love. I hope this letter finds you. I, I know, know it would be a miracle, miracle but, but you, you made, made me believe in miracles. in miracles. Despite all odds and countless obstacles, one can find their soulmate, and you are mine, my beloved. Now all I have is the blessing and curse of memory. Pleasure and pain joined in all my thoughts of you. I would do anything, give anything to have you back. But you are gone, my love. Lost to me forever. And I am lost without you. Know that I will always love you with all my heart and soul. And that I will wait for the day, the hour, the minute that we can be together again. True love. This is what true love is. This letter, it just moved me so deeply to read it. The love that this man and woman shared for each other, it's just so passionate, yet so pure. I mean, to think that this man and woman shared a love that was so strong that he would do anything to reach her, even put a message in a bottle. I remember my father telling us a story about Irishmen crossing the ocean to come to America. He said that a lot of them had to leave their families behind. So they would write letters and put them in bottles, seal them up, 
toss them back in the sea, hoping one day somehow that they would find their way back to their loved ones in their home. That is so beautiful. I wonder what it's like to be loved this much by someone. What am I saying? I know what that kind of love is like. It's the one thing from my past that I do remember. Right. You had a strong, special love. One that transcended space and time. I wonder. I wonder what? I wonder if this letter is for me. If it's from the man that I love. Maybe this letter is to me. Maybe it's from the man that I love. <laughs> you know, I, yeah, it could be. I mean, after seeing the way that the Bermuda Triangle is in a flux the other day, I, anything's possible. Ryan. You're so wonderful to try and give me hope when you know what I'm hoping for is the impossible. Diana. No. I... I know. I'm, I'm just grasping at straws here. There's no way this letter could be to me. You're so wonderful to not want to burst my bubble, though. Hey. I just want you to be happy. To have love in your life. To have love and happiness. Yeah, I want that. Maybe you're right. Maybe I'm always looking to the past for something that's long gone. But my happiness could be right here in the present. Closer than I think. <laughs>